Welcome to the Arva 690 diesel. I love Arva boats. I go back a fair while with Arva boats too. These are a little bit unusual in the fleet of trailer boats because this is actually a four cylinder diesel shaft drive. And for anybody who's had boats on a mooring type scenario in the water a lot, there's nothing simpler than a shaft drive. They give you great longevity, great service, great power and amazing economy, especially when backed up with the might of the four cylinder diesel as well. The new trawler style cabin with the upright windscreen in the Arbor has really given it so much more internal space, a lot more internal feel. It's a really functional layout. There's great seating, plenty of storage, a lot of features, comfortable, just a well-sized dashboard that's right in your face so you know exactly what's going on. This one's got the, uh, the trolling valve to control your throttle setting for trolling. You can adjust it really fine, which is great for running your lures. Well, here's the might and power of the Arvor, and that's the Mercury 115 horsepower diesel under here. She's a four-cylinder common rail diesel with a shaft drive. You can't beat it for simplicity, you can't beat it for longevity, and you can't beat them for economy and service life. What a great little combination, and perfect for a stacking, or a moored, or a trailable scenario. And this one with the option of the cockpit controls. So with the 690 diesel, we've got the, the big cockpit space. Uh, that's the main feature that we can, we can offer to the serious fishermen out there. It's got the high gunnels, full self-draining, got a deck wash pump, so it sort of allows people to get out in some really, really nasty stuff, but you know, it's enjoyable and comfortable on this vessel. The Arvor 690D is probably the most different boat in this entire field. It, it comes from an older school. It's very European in its design. They grew out of North Sea fishing, originally designed in France and now built in other places in Europe. But a very traditional style of boat. For what it's meant to be, it's very, very good. It's a, it's a comfortable, solid, safe feeling boat for people who aren't in a dreadful hurry to get somewhere. And, and if you fall into that category, you're going to love it. The wow factor with the Arva, I think, is that uh, pilot house lockable cabin concept, uh, which is unique. Um, I like the, uh, the fact that it's um, uh, inboard uh, diesel shaft drive, that's unique, and it probably suits that layout and, and uh, design of boat quite well. The Arva 690D, again, fitted with a diesel. Now, it's got the Mercury 115 horsepower turbo diesel engine, which Sounds like a pretty low horsepower for a boat of this size. Interestingly, it's got a semi-displacement hull which jumps it up onto the plane very easily and you can operate this boat at low speed and low revs. So the 115 for this boat is actually pretty good and very, very surprising when it comes to the performance. The price of the Arbor, it's over $100,000, but there's a lot of fiberglass in that. Very, very versatile boat. It's the sort of boat you can go offshore uh, go offshore fishing, it's got fitted up with game poles and good, good uh, bait tank and so on. So Arvor is a European brand that builds a lot of boats that sell globally. Their quality is almost second to none. Their fitting and their finish is very, very good. Everything fits perfectly like it should. And their design and layout is probably second to none. Arvor Boats, a true individual in the marketplace and in this competition. It's a diesel shaft drive. They're simple, they're safe, they're economical, and they're reliable. They do have uh, outboard alternatives as well, but to me, the longevity and the safety and the minimal uh, maintenance, whole heap of features come together with this boat to make it a great all-round package. And look at the layout. You can walk around, plenty of room, plenty of space, and a great little fishing boat to boot.